How y'all doing? Hope y'all doing great. I'm back with another video. I know it's been a while, but I'm here now. <laughs> so today's video is going to be about something I'm interested in or was interested in. And I did the research and kind of found my answer. And I was just looking up uh, the most like the highest paying tanker truck companies. And I'm just going to basically give you all a top five list of what I found. So number five is going to be Venencia Transportation. Venencia is made up of three different bulk divisions, liquid, dry bulk, and what they call specialty. Headquartered in Pennsylvania, they have 500 trucks, 1,200 trailers, and 16 terminals in nine different states. They're also family owned and what everyone clicked on this video for their salary they have an average salary of ninety four thousand dollars now again this is all alleged i've never worked for venencia transportation haven't spoke with anyone at work there or or anything uh, but online is showing that this is one of the top five paying tanker truck carriers in the country so <clears throat> good news for you they are hiring if you're interested uh venencia transportation uh google them give them an application and uh good luck all right coming in at number four is we have grondike transportation also family owned founded in 1932 by harold they have 40 terminals in 15 states making them the fourth largest tank carrier in the country again the fourth largest tank truck carrier in the country not the largest but the fourth um, they're headquartered in oklahoma and they have a salary of ninety eight thousand dollars again this is alleged i'm not sure exactly what you have to do to get to the ninety eight thousand dollars i'm not sure if that's a top out but they have drivers earning over or at least $98,000 over at uh, Ground Dyke Transportation. And again, all the companies I'm, I'm listing on this list are hiring. So give them a call if you're interested. All right. Coming in at number three is we have Flyers Energy LLC. Now, it wasn't much I could find about it. I know it's still... Um, allegedly family owned but it was founded in 1979 and they are headquartered in Auburn California and drivers can make up to one hundred thousand dollars here at Flyers LLC and Flyers LLC for those that don't know those are the guys that you'll typically see at your pl your pilot flying J's sorry about that filling up your um, there you guys all is at Pilot Flying J, for those that don't know. I heard a lot of different things about that company as far as being hourly and stuff like that. For more information, just Google them. They are hiring, though. They are hiring um, if you are interested. So good luck. We're getting through this list pretty quick. Coming in at number two is we have Superior tank lines not carriers but tank lines we all know who superior carriers got sold to anyways so superior tank lines was founded in 1989 by george uh also not much i could find about them but i do know that they have some state-of-the-art equipment some of the cleanest trucks on the road if you like some of the pictures i'm gonna show you'll see um, they got over 100 units. They service three states, California, Oregon, and Washington state. And the reason why they're on this list is because allegedly they have a salary of $106,000. Again, I do not know the steps that it takes to get there, but I do know that drivers can make up to one hundred and six thousand dollars here at superior tank lines and good news is they are hiring 
So if you're in any of those states that I mentioned, not sure what area, like cities and stuff, you can do your, your best at finding that out and apply. All right. Coming in at number one is we have CBSL. Headquartered in Chicago, Illinois. This is what the people say is the highest paying trucking company, tanker trucking company in the game. Probably trucking as well. Let's just be honest. But um, they have 500 employees. They are privately held. They have over 25 years of experience um, in bulk chemical bulk carriers, um, hauling, um, a lot of the trucks that I've seen, um, they do ISO containers and that's the stuff that comes from overseas and that's what you ship overseas, stuff like that. Um, but why they're on this list is because they have a salary of $124,000. Now, again, I don't know the steps that it takes to get there, but for a company that's listening that you can make as a driver, $124,000, I'm interested. And I want to know what that work-life balance looking like. You know what I mean? To get to that money and the experience that they do require to work there. Um, they got locations in Louisiana and uh, Texas. If people are interested in looking this company up and seeing what you can do to get on board. Now, again, <clears throat> thank you for coming, clicking on to my video. I'm going to have more videos uh, down the road. Just let me know what you're interested in looking at, and I'll see you in the next video. Hey, how y'all? Before I let you go, Flyers Energy LLC. I was wrong about that information as far as it being affiliated with Flying J. They're not. They're not. They are their own entity, and they are located in Auburn, California, at least um, headquartered there. And... Hourly, they are starting anywhere from $32 to $34 an hour with overtime pay. So I can see how you can make some good money. Um, again, I apologize about the information. I'm not sure where it came from. Uh, thank you for clicking on the video and enjoy your day. Bye.